put a sun scene. Haven't been a good day for you? Can we come in and talk to you? Huh? Can we come in and talk to you? Sure. Where's she at? And this is your wife? Is anything broken? Nothing's broken? What about this lighter fluid issue? Okay. And that was today? Last night. Last night. Did that get reported last night? She doesn't want to get another in trouble, but she wants people to know that she's doing this stuff. She's over there and, and she's living with the boyfriend right now. And um, took all the stuff off the porch, sprayed the house with the lighter fluid, or not lighter fluid, charcoal. Sure, sure, sure. Is anything broken downstairs? Well, let's go take a look at that. She watched over there. I was here a couple weeks ago. Okay. How did she do that with her arms? She started it. I mean, she didn't hit it with a bat or anything like that. No, no. I mean, she destroyed it. This used to be a real nice, cute room. So she just come over here, tipping everything over and everything. But she did some knives on the floor too that she was. Maybe she fixed them back up. I don't know. Oh, there's one of them back there. Where's the other half of this drywall at? It's around the corner here. Oh, well, there it is, laying right there. Yeah. I can probably put it back up there and patch it and stuff like that. And that happened last night? Yes, after she got back from the daughter's house? Yes, yes. What was the argument over at the daughter's house? I have no idea. I have no idea. So you weren't over there? No, sir. This is stuff that you heard from yeah, the daughter. Know. What's your daughter's name? Melissa. Melissa? <laughs> sure. Okay. What's Melissa's last name? What's Melissa's last name?
an argument last night, and she left to go to her daughter's. Well, she does this automatically. I don't argue with her. Okay, so she was she mad when she left here? Yes. Over what? I don't know. I don't even know why she's mad today. That's the problem. If I knew, I'd, I could probably maybe help it. Mm -hmm. you know? but not knowing what in the hell is going on. She won't tell me. She just was. So, well, I walked outside. I was sitting in a chair. And, the time she brought him on, I thought, well, this is a good time to maybe start a little conversation. She turned the hose on and told me to do it the hose and garbage shot. And that was earlier today? Yes, sir. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I slept here last night. How long have you guys been together? Well, it's been 22 years since I've known her and 19 years of marriage. And no kids together? Okay. It's just the two of you live in the house? Yes, sir. Well, Melissa used to come back and stay with us until we got to it. And we came back to make sure that... Adam, too, and I could get a corporal for a photo. Just, you guys just talk to her. What's her name? Janet. Just talk to her, and, and if you guys don't see something wrong, then maybe... I've gone to see a psychiatrist twice, to see if it's my fault. Mm-hmm. Okay. It, it's, I'm in depression because of this, deep depression because of this. And he told me, the second time I saw him, I was in the and he had the same burn up. And they said, if you don't get ready to do a problem, it's the next one day. Well, I told them that it's not, I do not want to lose her. She was a fantastic woman because she got healed. Mm -hmm. You know, she was a baby nurse, I mean, RM baby nurse, she helped deliver babies, take care of babies, make sure they're breathing. And she's a really intelligent lady, and a very good lady, really. But she has definitely... Has she on the beds, or what's going on? I don't know. See, see they put her into the psych ward up there. the last time I was here, was a couple, three weeks ago? Yeah. You left for the day. Yes. Did mental health ever come out here? Oh, and it was a uh, senior citizen who was supposed to be out here yesterday, and some other group, I think, to see if they could help us figure it out. Well, nobody showed up. And I really need somebody to show up to talk to her, to talk to us. Me too. Right. I don't want to be left out. I want to know if I'm going to find it wrong. I'm wrong. You know, let's fix it. That's the way I feel about it. But you guys are here. So she was down there by herself when she busted the uh, wall out? Yeah. You hear her holler and scream and then... know you're being audio and visually recorded. Oh. What is going on today? This young fella out here says that you're causing problems and tearing up the house. Why is he saying such crazy talk? Because it's true? Well, I have been doing trying to make a path yeah. Find my cell phone. Is that what you're looking for? Is looking for a cell phone? Yeah. What was the deal last night at your daughter's house? I went over there to talk with her. Yeah. Regarding what's going to happen to your... Our money. Our oh, money. checking account. Yeah. Okay, I just didn't understand you. Okay. And then what happened? And I had to walk the black men. Oh, uh, Okay. Is this her boyfriend or her husband? I believe he's still her boyfriend. I don't know. 
crossing your fingers? I am. Okay. And my legs too. <laughs> <laughs> um. So you went over there and talked to her about the joint account. I went over there to see if what she would say. How much is money's missing? It's been it's been being rotated in and out of the account. Yeah. And the last entry I remember was to the mother's clothing in Portland, Oregon. You can go if you need. I got him. You can go. Okay. And. I found a bag of little girls that you weren't even close to. And I'm going, I didn't buy them. And I don't know how they arrived here. Because I'm being <coughs> crazy. Okay. Did you spray lighter fluid on her house? Try to set her house on fire, nothing like that? Did you get assaulted or at all? Or uh, did she, she, grabbed my arm. she grabbed your arm? Whereabouts? Right Are you bruised or injured at all? I still have the children part. The doctors told me that there's a twelve year old dress in quite nice but to still take it easy with it. Mm-hmm. Not to re injure it badly. She still went How did the uh, drywall and the stairwell get broken? Um, that was when St. Paul left her so-called husband mm -hmm. <laughs> seven years married mm -hmm. or seven years of living together and he claimed her as his wife. And he used to ride around the living room and call her my wife and my husband and his mother made her new question. And I How long ago was that? So the hole got put in the wall in the stairwell in 2009. I believe it was probably 2010. 2010. Yeah. So two pushing three years ago. Yeah. But the drywall still laying on the floor in there. He, it, he hit the side of the wall when he fell down with that drywall on top of it. Sure. And it was wobbled like that, ready to fall. 
Why is your husband saying that you did that last night when you came home mad? That doesn't make any sense to me. I didn't. Well, why would he say that? I mean, he's got no reason to lie to me. Go well, look down the stairs. I did. What's it look like in that front, or that bedroom? He said you tore that up today, too, turning everything over. Yes, I did. Okay. To okay. I found butcher knives. Right. Like this. Between the mattress. I'm worried about the drywall, because all that stuff can be turned back over, but you broke the drywall. Well, I'm sure that the owner of this police house would be quite interested to find out about that. I agree. And before that, we had already been making previous visits up here, finding <coughs> drywalls and all kinds of flaws in the motor home parked outside mm -hmm. that had put their sewer line down into the sewer home downstairs. And they were also draining crap into the neighbor's yard next door. Town and court. So what's going to happen when we leave here today? Are you going to have any more problems with your husband? No, because I'm leaving. You're leaving? I'm going to go take a ride. Okay. i got business to take care of. Perfect. I've got to go down to the bank and put her things up there. And I've got to talk to another credit union. And I've got plans I've got to do. And well, tell me again about the drywall, because I don't believe you that it was broken three years ago. I think that just happened, because the drywall's still laying on the floor down there. So how did that get broken? When he fell into it. Not, not three years ago. Two years ago. Not in 2010. It didn't happen two years ago. It didn't. I'm just telling you. It didn't, it didn't happen that way. Well, you can believe him or believe me. Well, I'm believing the evidence, and I don't think you would leave there drywall. There's so many people up and down the stairs. Who do you think was downstairs? What I'm saying is, I don't think that you would leave broken drywall laying on your floor for two years. I'm not going to say another word. Okay. Do you want to go to jail today? Fine. You want to take me to jail? I don't really want yeah. to, but I can. Handcuff me. Drag me down on my knees. Throw me on the floor. I don't want to do that. Do that. I'm trying to get the story out of you. I don't believe you that it happened two years ago. I'm not going to keep barfing up garbage. That's not garbage. It's damn true. Okay. Well, let's step outside. Grab your sunglasses and your car keys. You're going to go for a ride, right? You still going for a car ride? I'll ride my car where I'm going to ride. Right, but you're still going to do that. Okay, well, let's go outside. Okay, we'll get those too. I know exactly what they are. They're cigarettes, and I don't know where they're at. I do not. What I'm going to do is I'm going to write you a citation. You're going to have to go to court to explain why the drywall got broken. But then you'll be free to go and you can go on your car ride. And you won't have to go to jail. But we need to step outside to my car to... Uh, he's outside somewhere. I have no idea if he has money or not. But you got to go to my car real quick so I can get you the paperwork. Cut up my Hi, kitty. Our car is over here to the left. You can see it with the hazards on. Or you can sit here on the stairs and I'll do it and you can hang out with my partner. Whichever's that one, that would be better for you? Okay. I'll be right back with the paperwork, okay? You can't go anywhere, though. Stay with her. Criminal sites? 
You got any criminal citations? Do you have your ID card on you? Ma'am, you got your ID on you? It'll just make it go that much quicker so I can get you out of here. Okay. Just bring it over to me when you get it. Where did you set up at? And I'll set the rest accordingly. Ridgeview Place in Central. Or 
530. Government advised non life threatening injury over here at the shrimp pump. Copy, thank you, non life threatening. You are at 30, go ahead. I just got the tail end of this thing. Why you get on a black mountain bike just pulled out of the Shadow parking lot? Is that involved in something? Where did that broke up? What, what's his description? Start baseball cap, about 14 years. Or he's younger than that. Red shirt on a black mountain bike. Miss 280, what do you think? Oh, BMX for sure. It was a dark blue shirt. No, it's going to be a different subject. Thank you. Downstairs, hall, uh, stairwell. Is your husband still in the back? I don't know where he's at. Let me slide past you here and get through this door. And I will be right back in a second to explain all this to you, and you can get out of here, okay? You could even make your way over to your car if you wanted to. You just can't drive off till I explain that to you. There we go. Perfect. Thank you. This is what started most of it in here was this hurt, but nothing really, I mean everything's tipped over, but nothing's broken, supposedly. Still out here hanging out? Alright. She's gonna leave. Go for a ride. It's outside of the four hour window as far as taking her to jail, and we're just way too busy right now. So I'm writing her a citation for breaking the wall. She's gonna have to go see a judge about that. Um, if she comes back later tonight causing more problems, give us a call. Okay. I hope not either, but just in case she does. But yeah, it's outside of. About what time last night did she come home? Roughly. In the morning? Okay. Alrighty. <coughs> Sir? What is this? Uh, DV mail, miss. But it's outside the window, so it's just a sight and release. Thank you. Yeah, he's in the backyard hanging out. All right, here's your ID back. Let's get you that so you can get out of here and drive. Um, for busting a wall. Okay, I wasn't here, but based on everything that I see, and it kind of makes sense to me, so you'll have to explain that to a judge. You've got a court date on October 3rd. Here, let me circle this for you. October 3rd at 1.30. If you can't make that, if you got something going on, call this phone number down here and reschedule it. Okay. Do you have any questions, ma'am? I apologize. I wish we could have met under better circumstances, but...